All right, guys, so we're in Ohio, man. Just got here underneath this giant cell tower, but the view of this restaurant is nuts. Goodness gravy guys, we are in Ohio and this is day one of being in Ohio. I came here for a uh, vintage pop-up that's going down tomorrow, but you guys know when I'm out of state, I have to hit a Goodwill and a few thrift stores. This is a brand new trip to the thrift where I sift, I dig, I find items to flip, to keep and everywhere in between. We're outside of Good Williams Jr. Let's get up in here and see what's going on and see if I can bring my thrift blessings to Ohio. Let's get it. All right, guys, here we are, live in the building. And one thing I have to say is these Goodwills look like actual stores. Way nicer than in Houston, not gonna lie. And also the prices are way nicer too. All the t-shirts are $2, no exceptions. And the button-ups are like $4.49 or $4.39, something like that, which is amazing. And just know, I have found some things up in here. I feel like the vultures of Houston would have already been snacking on these vintage corpses, if you will, in terms of t-shirts. Anyways, you have the Led Zeppelin. Oh yes, Banty. This is early 2000s, 2003, right oh, there. Haynes heavyweight tag. You got the number four Nash car T. Bruh, skirt, skirt, Budweiser. That boy Kevin Harvick. Oh, Kevin. <laughs> and then I found a couple of Harley pieces. You got the Harley Davidson polo right here. Amazing Palm Springs, California. And then what's cool is the buttons are even metal, something like the rims of a motorcycle. And then to go with it, another $2. I love my wife, but I love Harley better. Look at this, Black Hills Harley Davidson, Rapid City. It actually says something else. Um, it says, I love it when my wife says, go for a ride. Okay, see, subtle, huh? Subtle, subtle right there. Big Eagle looking lethal. Y'all know what time it is. The first store is coming through, and I like it. I like it a lot, yeah. Oh, going straight medieval. Dude, two of my favorite low-key brands are in here, or at least one of my brands, two of their product. Knights of the Round Table, 90s Vertical, and Horizontal Stripes. You also have this nice little single stiatch, Cincinnati Synchron Gators to comb about. I don't know what this is, but this is a cool little essential graphic on it. Made in USA on Screen Stars, baby. I think I might get it, we'll see. Dude, this is what I'm talking about. These Goodwills are for the people. Look at the jacket prices, my guys. $6.99? Nah, we know what that is. It's seven! But check it out, dude. If I lived over here, you know, you got a couple of essential Nike hoodies for seven bucks a pop. This one's in the nice Oilers color scheme, too. Good Lord. Dude, look what my lovely lady done found, too. The Gettysburg all embroidered Pennsylvania with the cufflets on the neck and the essential starter in the Dijon mustard colorway, bruh. Let's go. Oh, why are they holding Mickey hostage behind the cellophane? He can't even breathe in there. Bruh, someone let this man out. All right, we're about to depart, but the last shirt, which was just sitting here in the men's fashion collection, is the awesome stressed out, angry catty, claws percolating, eyes extremely hazy and yellow. I need it, two bucks. My goodness, man, I was not expecting this. First stop of the day, man, y'all know what time it is. Dude, this Goodwill gave me good vibes. I usually am harsh on Goodwill, but hey, in Ohio, it's a whole different tale. All right, guys, and we have arrived at Ohio Thrift. Obviously, I've never been here, but as uh, Vivian said, it looks popping. The parking lot is semi-full, so we're gonna see what's going on at Ohio Thrift. Gang. Anyways, guys, this store is another big one. 
The bigger, the better, baby. Let's see what's going on. Yo, the generic Go Team Deadstock hats? Flawless. Hey, the Bounty Racing. That's pretty clean, dude. All right, guys, we got the three for right here. Castrol GTX Racing to go with the Bounty, right? And then you have the racist Armadillo Vintage Trucker hat. Ah! Oh, my God! Personal file tripping by the offense number 15. Okay, guys, so this store is full of just a bunch of generic clothes. Like, it doesn't seem like a lot's donated. It seems like this stuff might be coming predominantly from stores because it's just blanks in terms of t-shirts, crewnecks, and everything of that nature. So maybe you have a screen printing business, this store could work for you. Um, they also have a lot of Mac tools, jerseys in terms of both baseball and uh, football jerseys. All right, y'all, I think I'm blowing this popsicle stand empty handed. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> one in the super noteworthy piece are these, the Ian Connor times Jordan brand times air max collab effortless effortless all right guys thrift store number three also has a packed parking lot so we'll see what's going on up in here this is the volunteers of america thrift store god bless hopefully they have a little bit more in store than the last spot we'll see though all right guys in here already another big environment they have Ohio State gear for only six bucks. I'm gonna grab this Nike jersey for show because um, I'm gonna take a picture outside of their campus. And they have the Sanu jersey for only 10 bucks. Not too shabby for daddy. Dude, let's run it up. Five bucks. Another one, Ohio State big jacket. I gotta nab it, dad, nab it. <laughs> let's get it. All right, this is absurd. It's like I had no Ohio State gear. And now I have three pieces, all three of them. All three of y'all. Champion vintage pullover, look at the neck. Tree dollars, oh my goodness. The trio's complete, straight up. All right guys, I really geared up with all the Ohio State. I see this money through my Ohio State bus, guys. Huh, checks over stripes. This is a, a made in, is it made in USA? It's a 2000s made in Honduras of US fabric. Center check Nike Ohio State tee. And then check out this Harley tee. Kind of eh, plain Jane on the front, but the back is chromed out. Little Rock, Arkansas. And then I got the Dog Pound. Cleveland Browns camo. What on earth would this blend into? Maybe just a pile of rust. That's nuts. Hey, you guys know the real find of the day is the homie Johnny Quinn who pulled up in the building. Top to draped bottom, up and dripped out. 100% thrift fit. Shout out to my, out to my boy Shady. He works here. He filmed me all the hookups. <laughs> Sir. Shady, where you at, bro? Anyways, man, it's always dope seeing the people, especially Sir. because I feel like I just like sprung up in Ohio. Maybe I like glitch his matrix real quick, you feel sir. me? But I appreciate you, bro. Sure, bro. As always, man. Nice As meeting you, bro, for real. Yes, sir. Guys, store number three really came through. I'm blessed, I'm blessed, I tell you. Yes. Um, two bags full of stuff. You know, the Ohio State like leather jacket wasn't in the best condition, but I'm gonna take a banging picture. Maybe I should low-key like take this Honda element for the pick too. Just driving on Ohio State's field, man. Let's get it, dude. What a day. What a day. All right, guys, we're live in the venue. Look at the blue lights, amazing. It is loud, but uh, yeah, it's going down today. It's probably gonna be a bunch of B-roll, but let's get it. Dated, faded, worn, Columbus, Ohio. Hold up on me. How y'all doing? Columbus Ohio's in the house. She came all the way down here to represent the blood god. Yes, ma'am. We video. Y'all know what time it is. Hey, anyone who's trying to pursue these silver foxes, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Butterscotch teas. Look at I'm butterscotch. Mm. You need too much butterscotch, you might get cavity. Hey, get some of that in your life, though. You know if you got a sweet if you got a sweet tooth, take a bite, here. Right. It's always where your grandma's coffee table. 
And that's just facts. Hey, guys. Hey, swim in her DMs. You heard me? Hey, the vintage plug Max still pulled up in the building. Right. What you want to say to the people, bro? Call Plan 2, fuck t-shirts, plants are better. Exactly. Drink water. God bless. Water. God bless. We out here. The homie pulled up. Fishes get you hell up. Be at hey, you. Know, you know what time it is. Shout out Paul, man. You guys, this man is 100% genuine. Keep supporting what he does. <laughs> oh, yeah. Shout out to Shack. Pop a little student. The Shack on Instagram. T H E S H C K. Shout out Paul, bro. Hey, hell yeah. Paul. Hey, you guys go fuck with these men, man. Hey, smash that like button. Cool ass dudes. Yeah, smash that like button like a milf, boy. Y'all know what it is. Hell yeah. Mackenzie and Eric pulled up, and Mackenzie wants to bless me with this giant bug rocking the Marvin the Martian Sea. Hopefully, I sell enough to have room in my luggage for this dude, but that is amazing and that is love. Thank you so much, dude. That is crazy. <laughs> The homie Aaron pulled up on me and blessed me with a Ben's find. The Simpsons T, and he's been watching since I was getting what, like 150 views? 150 views a video. So that's damn near 10 years ago, bro. That's love, my man. That is love, bro. Wrap this up. The homie Retro Reese is in the building. And then I just got blessed with the what? I hate a goofy especially. Crazy, yeah, this is a super old school snapback too. Full plastic face, my God. Bro, what's your IG? Mind Flavor Vintage. Mind Flavor Vintage, man. Thank you, bro. Thank you, man. Yes, sir. Appreciate you. Yes! All right, guys, so we're back from Ohio in Texas. I'm still traveling. Hence why I'm at my parental's house, okay? Okay. But anyways, man, I had a great time in Ohio. I actually hit more thrift stores. Number one, I hit nine stores. Only three made the video and only two really had enough stuff to record in. Like I found some kid phone posits, I found some up tempos, and overall I was just like, yo, thrifting out here is trash! Like straight up, dude. There was like almost nothing to record. I only spent half a day thrifting, then I had the event, then I decided to go sightseeing on the third day while I was in Ohio, and then I flew back the fourth day. So I didn't have too much time, but I had to get out there, record a little something something, and record some footage at the events. Y'all know, man, I'm slinging clothes, answering questions, shaking hands, kissing babies, so it is hard to record, but I'm glad I got the footage I did. Shout out Heather and Mike for the plant and snapback too. And for everyone else who did pull up, thank you guys so much. I wish I had a cameraman or a person um, in Ohio to really record the full experience, but yeah, dude. I mean, sometimes the events just be crazy, okay? But I love you guys. Thanks for watching. We're back in Texas, so stay tuned. A lot of clothes have been dropping on the website because I've been back taking pics and uploading on thriftheadmanvintage.com. So follow the Instagram. That's how you guys know when drops occur. Follow my Instagram. I'm almost at 100K, so help me out if you guys aren't already. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching this stuff. Little dream. Eat that ice cream. And until next time, I'm locked, I'm loaded. I'm ready to raid the Texas trenches. And I'm out. See ya. Love you. Killing these songs, leaving a bloody life. I roost them. And I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get used to.